Today I'm bringing to you a hair grease I use on my skin. Yes, that's right, I said it. And it is... This hair grease smells so divine. I use this on my skin, on the elbows, on the knees. The reason being is it's enriched with vitamin E. And that hair grease is this. The Blue Magic Shea Butter Hair Conditioner. It says with coconut fruit extract, shine for all types of hair. Let's start with the price. This is a relatively cheap hair grease. It is £2.99. One penny shy from £3. Okay, let's just call it a good £3. The scent, oh. It reminds me of childhood. Mine was sweets. I just love sweets. This is what the product looks like. Can you see that? It looks like your typical tub of Vaseline. The texture is, it's got a nice sheen to it. Let me put some on my skin so you can see. It's got a nice shine to it. I like to run it down the limbs of my hair because the scent lasts. And yes, these are extensions and I do like to put some on the end. No, it's non-greasy. Once it's rubbed in, the greasy texture kind of goes. So let's just read what it says. By the way, guys, I have got a new merch line called It's Pronounced Pomade. If you'd like to purchase one of my t-shirts or a cup, why not? You can purchase it down below in my merch store. A thing that we have been denied for far too long. Back to the video. With coconut fruit extract and vitamin E will enhance hair softness while providing deep conditioning and shine for all types of hair, relaxed, flat iron or pressed hair says directions. Gently massage a small amount into the hair and scalp with fingers every day. Do not rinse off. Style as you prefer. Excellent for pressing. Follow directions provided with styling tools. Now where it says can be used every day, that is exactly what I do. In the morning, I spritz my hair with a bit of H2O, you know, just get it going because when you do have extensions in your hair, guys, it can tend to dry your hair, especially if it's synthetic hair. So I like to spritz my plaits, braids, not the sprays, whatever you want to call them, and I just kind of just take a light amount of hair grease of the Shea Butter Blue Magic, smooth it across my hands, and then just do the praying method down my strands. This is why my hair is looking so juicy and shiny. That'll work. Overall, just gorgeous. Right, so ingredients. Now, some of you might not like this and some of you might not mind it. I am one of those who do not mind it. The first ingredient is petrolatum. Second ingredient is shea butter. So I'm not sure if you're aware of how the ingredients list works. The ingredient that's the dominant ingredient is usually at the top of the list. So petroleum would be the base, I guess, the foundation of the product. The next dominant ingredient in there, I guess, would be the shea butter. Secondly, coconut, safflower, oil, clove oil, wow. I've been seeing a lot of things about clove oil and how it grows your hair. Clove oil or boiling cloves and using it as a rinse. The fact that this contains clove oil shows that there are ingredients in there that are excellent for growing and nourishing your hair. Now, I forgot to mention in my last video, I was talking about ingredients, I should say, that stimulate your hair. I'm not saying that ingredients don't help to stimulate your hair because I know rosemary oil does and from the last video, I know that sulfur does, but it's the way that you apply it also. If you massage, you stimulate the area so for instance if you are massaging your scalp massaging your edges whilst applying the product it goes hand in hand through my experience it's not just necessarily the product itself it's the application process of the product I have before just put oil on my hair and just let it do its thing that's it just dabbed it right and I've done that for a reason because I wanted to see where my hair was thinning if there was going to be a rapid increase in growth but the other side, I actually put the oil on and I massaged it in for about two to five minutes, let's say. And that side actually picked up a lot quicker. So I do believe it's the stimulation of the follicles which help blood flow to the area as well as helping the product to penetrate into the strands. This is a 12 ounce tub and just like my hair greases, I have half a tub lying around. I use them up until a certain point. And not to say that I'm finished with them and then I move on to the next, but then I always go back. That's why I love the fact that you have the big tubs, you know? Right, as I said, the smell is just divine. I can't compare it to anything. Um, and a lot of you guys have said that you do love the shea butter. So let's talk about application. The way that I like to apply this one, as I said, I use it daily. I did say that I go down my strands with it, but I also do like to put it on my scalp. And let me just quickly show you. So I just smooth it on my scalp. Can you see that shine, guys? And due to the shine, it keeps my hair looking fresh. No, it does not block my follicles. I don't have any bumps. It's rid of any dry skin that I may have. So you can see my scalp is nice and clean. I've had this style in since mm, maybe about 
two to three weeks now. No itching. Whenever I have my hand protected start, I get an itchy scalp after maybe about four to five days. This one I can absolutely say gets rid of the itching, guys. And it's just so soothing. In regards to putting it on wet hair, I'm not entirely sure how it will work. I will have to try it myself. But one thing I will say, it has a similar texture to the Blue Magic Wheat Gem. In fact, it's a little bit more softer. This one's a little bit more rigid, I'd say. Even though it's smooth, it's a little bit more rigid. Whereas this one is a lot more softer. Slightly more like an oil. But if you found this review helpful, and you think you want to have a look at some more hair greases, don't worry guys, I've got you covered. You're gonna need to click this video now.